Welcome back to Saying Goodbye to Gasoline. On today's episode, I'm going to be talking about auto parking, both in a regular spot and parallel parking. I know both of those things, reversing into a spot and then also parallel parking, kind of give me anxiety. So with the auto park, it kind of takes care of everything for you. It sees a space that it wants to go into or that it's able to go into. And the only way that it sees that is if there's two cars on both sides. It can't just read the lines on the road, which I thought it would have been able to do, but maybe in a future software update. But once it sees those two cars, it just kind of calculates, all right, here's how I need to come in here. It'll straighten itself out. It'll adjust itself. And you're done. That's all you need to do. Really once it sees that and and you're going to see it on the parallel parking side too once it sees oh i can actually go into that spot a little p comes up on the screen and it's like hey i'm ready to park that place right there as soon as you see that p you just press it on the screen and then you shift into reverse and then that's when it tells the car oh okay i need to take over i'm gonna park for you so with this one here this was just the reverse park very simple, very easy, you know, hey, I want to park backwards, I want to reverse into this spot so that when it's time to go, I can just go straight forward and get out of here. This is just like another angle to show you what it looks like, what the car is seeing, and it's like, hey, all right, I'm not going to be able to make this. You can see I have my hands off the wheel there, I'm just taking a look at the reverse screen. And the Tesla Model 3 takes over. This is the type of technology and software that I really wanted the Tesla for. And it's just been, I think it's just paid off. You know, my investment in the Tesla has paid off. This is really the next level software. This is the iPhone on wheels that I really wanted. So you can see I just kind of backed in there and I'm good to go. For the parallel parking, it was a little bit trickier just kind of finding a spot just to demo this on. In my area, I was kind of like, oh, wait a minute, where is an actual spot? And then also, where is a spot where two cars, you know, left an opening? And I was just, I just happened to drive by this spot and say, oh, shoot, here we go. This is a chance for me to parallel park it. And the parallel parking really gives me more anxiety than the reversing into a spot. The parallel parking, I've always kind of, even when I first learned to drive, I was like, uh, I'm, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to leave that to the professionals. Leave that to the valeters. So here you see that P I was talking about. You just press it. Hey, I got to go into reverse. Press the start button. And that that's all you need to do. You don't have to do anything else. Um, if you do need to stop it, you can just put, push the brake down and it'll stop it. But pretty much it just takes care of itself like I said you can kind of relax and just like with the full self-driving it's just something that kind of takes a little bit of the pressure off takes the stress off from driving and leaves you feeling more refreshed once you get to your de destination so that's auto park on the Tesla Model 3 I really like it it's a cool feature and hopefully it just gets better as it goes on you know they just kind of continue to improve it and with software updates, I think it's just gonna get better and better. So also something that's gonna get better and better is this YouTube channel saying goodbye to gasoline. And we can really use your help if you wanna go ahead and just give us a thumbs up down below and subscribe if you haven't. Also hit that notification bell so you know anytime I post a new video. I'm trying to post once a week. Um, so. If you have any other comments or questions, if you want something shown, hey, how does that work? Leave me a comment down below and I'll make that video for you. So once again, goodbye, gasoline.